It's a good spreader. It shoot. Yeah, it's a good spreader. <laughs> it's it's shoot <laughs> but also, it's shooting out three, three peas, only hitting one thing at a time. There, now it's hitting two. Hmm. You know, those would be a good light blocking ground. Yeah. Yes. Plus, if you put those down, you won't have to worry about pea shooters beside them, and you can invest in other things. Oh, crap. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is going to get intense. Wait, hang on. I can just install that one here. <laughs> he calls He's putting a plant it. down and installing it. I mean, what do you call it? Planting come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes. <laughs> Jerry bomb, away! <laughs> oh, God, it's the scuba zone. I know what this fucking scuba zombies do. I'm about to find out right now. Oh shit! The scuba zombies dive into the water so they can't be hit by oncoming projectiles. Wait, I have an idea. Oh fuck, you need to squash! Yeah, I gotta wait until it loads. Fuck, it's taking forever! Oh wait, I think it's vulnerable. Okay, it's vulnerable. If... Don't fucking play that shit to me! <laughs> oh, this is not good. <laughs> I feel yeah. like whenever you play that that music, like Golden just enters his flight or fight response. Hello. It's fight or flight or whatever the fuck. And you you can't it. shoot the scubas. You needed to wash Wait. on the dirt. Oh, that's cool. So when you take when you kill the when you take the heads off the snorkel zombies, they drown because they don't have the snorkels in. Cherry bomb away. Oh damn it. I gotta... oh, Shit! Surprise. The squashes take oh. forever to load. Okay, oh, so yeah, they're big boys. I wonder if that's gonna be like a holy hand cherry bomb or something. That probably won't be. Join this. Holy ham grenade. Ham. If you're here, peeing, you know it. Clip your ham. How do you guys feel about ham, like in a general sense? I mean, we have turkey ham over here in the UK, and that tastes pretty nice. Oh. Uh, use. Huh? Turkey ham? Yeah. Oh, god ham. damn it. I misclicked. That sound? Okay. Turkey bacon I can get behind. Bacon is a cut of meat, not a type of meat. But turkey ham. That sounds like an abomination. That sounds like a big <laughs> griffin that was killed and meated. Not, not dressed, not cut up, meated. Yeah, like, fuck I, you. <laughs> what is what is turkey ham? Like, I think it's like how normal ham slices are made, but like they mix the meat with turkey, so, so they put it together. Ham, ham. Then oh Jesus! Mm. Well, I don't know how it works. All I know is that it somehow incorporates turkey. Oh God! Yeah, no shit. Yeah, that's what I thought. Cherry bands. Yeah, cherry bomb away. Uh, well, I was about to say something that was going to actually, for real, get you banned, so I'm going to not. <laughs> Here, another squash. Maybe we shouldn't. Yeah! Take it down. Game the squares. Wait. All right, so I got another new item. Die! What the <laughs> fuck are you? <laughs> Aquatic plant that pulls a zombie underwater. <laughs> that would be fucking useful. Took you long hey, enough. Welcome to the backyard levels, my friend. Oh man. They're going to be especially oh, I useful. You made it to the backyard. All right, so oh, lily pad, tangle kelp. Fucking golden going into his going backyard, giggity something. Shut up. I, I refuse. <laughs> okay, so two more slots. Cherry bombs are always useful, and you know what? I'll go for the squash. I, I'll definitely choose the spreader over the repeater. <laughs> I would take shotgun over a thematic rifle any day. Chuckles in lewd. <laughs> choose the spreader. <laughs> I mean, same. <laughs> welcome to the back. <laughs> welcome to the back door. Now spread welcome them. To the backyard. <laughs> <laughs> God damn it. I, I know, can't turn it it's off. A, it's, like, it's a shame that we don't have 
like enough influence with people to just be able to say shit like, hey, make art of this and just guarantee that it'll exist. I mean, I'm in this call, but you, you couldn't get me to do it. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> God, that gourd is so serious. Eat my stale Gosh. ass Little Caesars pizza. This is <laughs> devoid of all flavor. When did it get stale? It's been stale for like the past four hours. Oh, so it was stale when you started eating it. Yeah. Huh. You know what you can like do? pizza. When it's good, it's good. When it's bad, it's still pretty good. Yeah. You know what you could do is, um, you put a little water on your hands, then you flick your fingers at it to get tiny water droplets on it, and then you put it in the microwave, on, and it warms side. up there and it just go. very slightly rehydrates. Myth, you are a goddamn genius. I went to a foods class. Hell yes. Where is I'm my microwave? It's in the kitchen, off. obviously. Where else would you keep it? Well, maybe the bedroom. <laughs> Wait, where else would you keep what? A, a microwave. microwave. And did you say a bedroom? Maybe. Mm. Yeah, I had a microwave in, in your bedroom? my bedroom. That shit was nice, bro. Yeah, I had that a brony cup. Wake up in the middle of the fucking night be like, man, I really want some popcorn. Oh, fuck, my microwave's right here. Oh. Mm -hmm. If it's on top of like a shelf or a cabinet, you just throw microwave snacks on there. It's like if you got something you need to microwave overnight, you can sleep to the soothing lullaby of. <laughs> <laughs> microwave overnight. See something that you just put that much radiation into overnight. I don't think I'd want to eat it the next day. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. I was thinking if you microwave something for more than five minutes, you you're like gonna melt whatever whatever's in there. Basically. Well, I mean, you could just turn the temperature way down, or however it works with microwaves, if that's even possible. <laughs> Microwave slow cooking. Now that's some quality gourmet shit right there. This is shut up, Shadow One Daniel. Thank shit. you for hosting. Again, we is like fucking. We're like that. We're like that meme that Solo was talking about before. Is like we invent microwave slow cooking, chef. <laughs> chef. With an S. These fucking pea shooters. Also, the peas travel really slow. Yes. We should get fucking MatPat from Game Theory to calculate their speed and whether or not they'd actually be deadly. They don't so, look like well, they'll be deadly. They're like bigger than the zombies' hands. Hmm. Plus, it'll give him something to do that isn't making himself look like an idiot making very unfortunate titles to videos about the coronavirus. Who will survive the censored virus? You, did no one... Did no one test this, Matt? It's clickbait. He's trying to get clickbait. That's what he's all about now. Yeah. Once when I was a child, they did a very stupid thing with... You cut out what? Once when I was a child, I did a very stupid thing. You cut again, out that You cut out again. Oh again, my god, Discord. I said once when I was a child, I did a very stupid thing with a microwave. Ah. Did okay. you put a penny inside of it? No, did you? No. <laughs> that would have been a fun story. <laughs> I yeah, it would have been fun for about 15 seconds until uh, I got my ass beat afterwards. <laughs> <laughs> Oh God, no! I had these friends. Okay, when I went to a slumber party with one of my friends, she said her her new stepmom or someone someone her dad was dating. Um, she was like, "Hey kids, you want to see something cool?" And she put a candy bar wrapper in the microwave, like the metallic kind, and turned it on, and it started to dance. And they were like, "Oh yeah, interesting." But the kids both knew, like, you can't do that. You weren't supposed to do that. No. Why is this grown ass woman doing it? <laughs> oh, really? Oh, wait, wait. Uh, there we go. <laughs> the stupid thing I did. Oh, over this. <laughs> oh, the squash can go out. <laughs> <laughs> I so know. The so the squash is the counter for the pole vaulter. Oh, okay. I saw what the squash did. That's awesome. 
Yeah. So like, hey, asshole! But it's not, like, I don't think so, motherfucker. That, the dumb thing that I did with the microwave was we had these small whole chickens uh, in our deep freeze when I was a kid, and I'm like, you know what? I want to cook a chicken, but not in the oven, because it takes forever. I want to microwave it. You're not so going to get past the squasher. Put it on a I plate, don't think so, motherfucker. And I it for like seven minutes, and it came out. It was still raw, and it's like surrounded by juice. Like, okay, pour off it's the juice. Fucking microwave raw. it some more. <laughs> and I was like, microwave it some more, microwave it some more, microwave it some more. It just kept letting off grease. And I'm like, I don't know, it's still pretty jiggly. Microwave it some more. <laughs> I spent like fucking half an hour just taking it out and putting it back in, and then it finally somewhat looked cooked. Mm -hmm. and I'm home alone, of course, doing this. Oh. And I cut some off and ate it, and I'm like, it tastes weird. Probably because I microwaved it. And I think I put it in the fridge or something. <laughs> and later yep. that night, I was so sick. <laughs> okay, oh dear! I have, I have a surprising story absolutely much, nobody. I have a story that's much the same. In fact, almost exactly the same. But it's interesting because of its conclusion. So, you guys know fucking turkey drummers, right? You mean drumsticks? We, yeah, so those. Well, leg. back when I was <laughs> six or seven, um, I decided. It would be a neat idea to try and make some turkey drummers for myself because no one was home. So I decided to put them in the microwave for, I think, 20 minutes. I did. And I did eat them. <laughs> and like most childhood ideas, they were wrong and stupid. <laughs> but there's the funny thing. Nothing happened to me. Apparently, any of the unforeseen consequences is so, just no. It's like I didn't suffer yeah. from any sickness. Nothing right. went wrong. I was just, you know, yeah, twenty my constitution mother was worried save. About. Yeah, twenty constitution. Again, hands down, I should not have been fine. <laughs> Are you just immune to salmonella? I don't know. We need to dissect logic. He's the cure to salmonella. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. Sorry, no, not dissect. You... No, we need to vivisect you. Oh. <laughs> yeah, there's That's even worse. Hold on. If even if someone found a cure for salmonella, wouldn't it be easier to just not eat raw food? <laughs> but how do you know if it's fully cooked? A meat thermometer. That's how you savages. Yeah. Technology has already solved the problem. Personal oh, capability will catch up sometime. I planted in the wrong spot. The I am four parallel universes ahead of you. Yeah. So, <laughs> uh, taken care of at least. so apparently, me and Myth were spared by natural selection. Me more so because I didn't Aaron, get I sick. sick. No, you got sick, but you didn't die. Oh, of course. Is it common to die from so many? I actually have no idea. I you just got sick for a while and then you got over. I could be incredibly wrong. Mm. Well, based on how worried my mother was at the time, I imagine it could have been real bad like that. Google. No, Wolfhead, ask Google. Can you die from salmonella? All right, well, I guess I'm going to ask Google, can you die from salmonella? <laughs> salmonella poisoning. <laughs> salmonella Fitzgerald. Also, why is it called salmonella if it's raw bird meat? Can you die from salmonella poisoning? According to WebMD, can you die from salmonella? Salmonella is rarely fatal, but if the bacteria enters your bloodstream, it can be life-threatening, especially for people with weakened immune systems, such as the elderly, the very young, and those with diseases like cancer and HIV AIDS. Okay, well, there's your answer. Okay. So it's okay. not necessarily really deadly to the digestion, but if it moves somewhere else, it can be. Okay. So salmonella is like self-inflicted COVID-19. Gotcha. <laughs> oh, Not fucking really. hell. Huh? Really? Because COVID presents with cold or flu-like symptoms? No. Okay. Honestly, it was just that, oh, it affects people with weaker, with weaker immune systems. Well, any disease affects people with weaker immune systems. That's, mm. that's what the immune system is for. It's protecting against disease. 